And now, an urgent appeal on behalf of the planet. I'm down here. How do I look from there? Not bad. <laughs> well, take a closer look. Do I look well to you? Ah, you've noticed then. I'm losing bits of me as we speak. <laughs> I'm receding rapidly on top and down there. Yes, go on, take a peek. Used to be dense forest full of life and diversity. Now it's a full Brazilian. If only my carbon emissions were in remission. You've pretty much exhausted me. Think of me as a life support machine. Supporting your business, your lifestyle, your children, your grandchildren. And they say the meek shall inherit the earth. Ha! Ah, I'm spent because you're spending it all now. You've doubled consumption of my resources in the last 30 years. Piling up debt like you own a global credit card. Saving for the future, who gives an earthly? And let's face it, I'm dripping because of your asset stripping. Oh yes, you can account for your GDP and your share price, but who's accounting for my losses? My P&L doesn't show up in your financial ecosystem because no one is adding up the cost of the damage. But then you haven't put a value on it. What's the real cost to the environment of a holiday overseas? The cost of a habitat? Cost of a diminishing asset? Cost of rising sea levels? Yet they're all costing the Earth and someone is paying a price somewhere. It's quite simple, really. Show us the money. Account for this damage. Start accounting for the real cost of production by showing these hidden costs. So we create a realistic profit and loss account for the planet, including the value of my depreciating assets. No, oh, and don't think you can rely on old crater face over there to sustain you. Accountants show hidden costs. They'll just cook the books, mate. Mm? Uh, tell me, Mr. Accountant, what's this Monteverdi golden toad worth to my business? Mm -hmm. Oh, I don't know. Mm? Is the toad tax deductible on that? Mm. This is about saving for the future by valuing what we have now. Listen to you, gurgling on about the price of an armadillo. The stock market suffered a shock collapse today when the value of the armadillo plummeted. You can moon all you like. Yeah, and you can drone on till it blew in the face. Look at you. When's the last time you had any life in you, eh? I'm due a probe in the next three years, apparently. Cheers. More spaceships that pass in the night, I shouldn't wonder. At least there's some atmosphere down here. Live today, gone tomorrow. That's what I say. Some of us plan to survive if we start accounting for what's left. Think anyone's listening out there? You must be living on another planet, mate. Just remember, you need me more than I need you. Think about it.